we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Right, golf mates, it's coming to an end of our trip. We're at Fraserburgh today, otherwise known as a Bruh. Seventh oldest golf club in the world. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. Right, golf mates, every good thing comes to an end. And today, we've come to an end. Only of the Hidden Gem Season 1, and we think we've brought you to a real gem. This is Fraser a Golf Club, the seventh oldest golf club in the world. And today, I think it's time me and you have a match, isn't it? Yeah. Finish the series on a high, a win for Liam. But this place is absolutely awesome. Mate, so we're going to have a match on this third hole here, 310 yards, but it's not as easy as it sounds. You'll see in a minute. Mr Barlow? Yeah. Odd or even for our match? Even. Odd. Your choice. I'm going to take the honours. So we here yesterday, we had a bit of a roll up day with the golf mates. 31 golf mates from all over the area turned up and we had what a night. But we're going to get more into that in the video. But this place might be the friendliest golf club I've ever played. Right, Fraserburgh. Let's tame the beast. Right, Mr. Harrison, come on. Let's finish on a high. I'm going to do it. What about you? I'm going to try my best. That's gone right to the bunker. It's a great shot. So, isn't it? Yeah, it's big. I love that. So, great. boys and girls, I've run out of tees on the trip and I've had to use these. This is how he rolls, Mr. Barlow. And you never lose them, golf mates. On the tee, Mr. Barlow, 310. Sun's coming out, lovely now. Digged it. Is he going to get over that first bunker? Don't know. Short of it and running. I think it's in that first bunker, Steve. I think it's short of it. Right, mate. Yeah. Not our best, but after last night. It's not a surprise. 100 yards uphill, might play a 110. Sun's coming out. In the bunker, is it massive? No, it's over. It's on. You've got away with that. I, I don't know if it's rolled off or what, but you've got away I with that. I thought you were going well right, that. That were like back of your head, that, mate. Bit thin. What, good looking? <laughs> or back of your head. <laughs> <laughs> so, golf mates, we're here because of Nick. You'll see him now. What a lad he is. And I'll be straight with you, every golf club needs a Nick. It does loads. Right, for about 50 yards, I think. Looks nice. Left to green, got a kick. I think it's massive, that. Yeah, I think it's big. Yeah. I should have zapped it, you know. Should have zapped yeah. it. Spanish it's Andy's on, it? come out now, chops, isn't it? You've got to get it up, down and stop it. So a bit of history of the course, because it's got a lot of history, this. Here's Eddie. He's, I'm going to call him the club Stato, but really he's a committee member who knows a lot of stuff. You're in for a good test of golf. It's a fantastic Lynx course. Uh, it's been here since 1891. Uh, the club was constituted in 1777, but had moved across here in 1891, and it was a local uh, peer that gifted the land for the course. And 13 is another par 4, which uh, has got a bit of history to it as well, which was uh, the ninth hole in Olympic course in Rio was modelled on the 13th hole at Fraserburgh, which is a nice little fact. So you're in for a good test of golf. Knows his stuff, doesn't he, eh? He does. Right. Not bad. Oh, it's a great shot. Wow, I thought that was short for a minute. That is proper Fast. Spanish hands. Fast. Right, Chops, you see mine? 
Very so fast. We're here in the morning after a night, as I keep saying. So the greens have just been caught this second. We're right behind the greenkeeper, Mr. Very Barlow. Fast. This will be tricky. Ooh. Have a look. That's not inside the circle of friendship, pal. No. And yours is a good four foot. Honestly? Yeah. I think we're making this hard, well you're alright, but we're making this all harder than it should be. Good put. No, yeah, we'll see that if we're playing for a five of chops. No worries. It's a knee tremble like that this time of morning, isn't it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Is that nervous? No, that's easy You're half. Nervous, though, aren't easy you? half. That's nervous. a gimme, that. Nervous. That should be a gimme, should be a nervous. shame. No, I'm not giving it nothing. Got a chance. That's a game. Right, golf mate, so with a depth to head greenkeeper here, Luke, what challenges have we got for a course like this? Um, I think the weather's obviously a challenge up here in northeast of Scotland. Um, it's been a challenge for me anyway. There's really, say, four kind of greenkeepers, um, one part time. And then a few volunteers. We, we were chatting to the captain, he gets stuck in, doesn't he? He's uh, full time, yeah. plus some. Is he? Is he a big help? Yeah. It definitely. seems like definitely. a captain what does everything at the club, he just loves it, doesn't he's, he? He's, if he's not on this side of the road on the golf course, he's over at the clubhouse doing something else. So Always. He's, he's a busy boy. Okay, golf mates, we brought you to the seventh. Par three, 165 yards. What a hole that is. It's beautiful. Surrounded by bunkers. Now we played it yesterday in the roll-up and that front bunker had my name on it. Don't want to do the same mistake. And the wind's got up. Weapon of choice, a six iron. I don't think that the wind's got up again. It has, it's in your face. That's gone left. Has it? Straight away left. Spanish hands needed, Mr. Barlow. Yeah. Mr. Barlow, I've opened the door. Yeah, we've got the uh, the international club. Come on, on the green, anywhere we'll do. What a par three this is, especially silhouetted now. He's gone with uh, rescue. Gone That's left, gone down left. Mate. Must have been in that. Oh yeah, Albert Mound. Wow. Me. <laughs> well, golf mates, there's a green somewhere. <laughs> it's over there. But yeah, we're over, over there. here. Yeah. <laughs> See, the wing got up, that Lynx golf. I wonder what it was, that's why I put my cap on, it was messing my hair up. Looks like you got two hopes to me, Bob hope and no hope. Well, you can see this golf, mate, so I'd wait yeah, the button hands on this. I pulled it, but it's massive here. Plenty of green to work with, but it's all downhill. Here's the button hands golf, mates. It's not bad. Tell you what, it's not bad. Oh. You've degreened it. <laughs> <laughs> right, a it's little bump and run, Mr. Barlow. He's forgot to take his shot. I'm not telling him. He can have it on the next. Unless he messes it up, I'll give it him. It's best shot. He's not old, has he? Has he? Oh, oh my shot Jesus. Uh, Was he cringing there, Mr. Harrison? I, I'm, I'm a bit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've just remembered as well. The bumping rump. No. You've got, I got, a shot. You've got a shot on here. Oh my Jesus. I'll, I'll save it for the next level. No, no, you can use it now. What? <laughs> we said shot in the middle hole. Are you going to have it? Shall I mark this? Yeah. I've gone deaf, I think. No, mark it, please. I've got wax, wax in my ears. You'll have something in your ear in a minute. Why would you want a shot on a par three? Well, get me on the next hole. I accept it. How's that? No, you're all right, pal. Well, I accept it. You like having shots, you. Real men just play for three holes. But you're the better golfer. The handicap says you're the better golfer. It's not even getting there, that. Still you. <laughs> Have you woke up yet? Shake it. the head, shake the head. Oh, oh shock. <laughs> I'll give you that. Oh, you're a... Do you know what? One up, Mr. Barlow. Okay. I'll just have a putt for practice, okay. One up, Mr. Barlow. What are you practicing here? Just me swing. 
You swing. Pendum. 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 The pendum. The pendum. <laughs> Cut that out, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Around the hole. Cut that out, Joel. It was a gimme. So, I've been playing with Mr. Barlow for a long time. And that was pure luck. Pure, pure luck. That was a great chip. What's pure up with that? Luck. Pure luck. That was the duff and run. One up, Mr. Barlow. Right, golf mates. Come to the tip of the course now, 13th. 305 yards off the yellows. The whites, which we played yesterday, were unreal. 340. Like I said, we wished for the workers of the late night. Mm. Good night, though. Very. So, right at the tip here, we've got a castle. I think this geezer in the castle had something to do with the course. We'll go back to Eddie Stato, because he knows a lot more than us. The land was gifted by the local peer, Lord Sultan. So we've been on site here since 1891, uh, and then we had a redesign in 1922, when James Braid, the uh, five times open champion, he did a redesign in 1922. Further mods were done in the 50s and the 70s. Uh, the, the course you see behind us is now a nine hole course, and we're 18 holes is across the road. So you've got their 18 and a 9 hole. And it's not like a 9 hole course where you think, hey, up, it's just a pitch and putt. Trust me, these are proper golf holes. In fact, we played them yesterday, the two little golf mates. We called them the proclaimers, didn't we? Yeah. We've but got the young lads here. We brought in the real stars of YouTube. But there's a problem, isn't there, boys? Yeah. Who's your favourite? Liam. And who's gonna, who are you playing with today? You. Who's your favourite? <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> 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 Mr. Barlow! Well, Liz, that Beautiful. Right, William, come on, come with me. Take come on then. Come on, take Get your tissue. Alright! Come on. You need the tissue. I know. It's for your partner. Oh, no, 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 Good shot. Wow! Get the club out! Oh, get the club out! Golf mates, when we hear all the noise, so young James is hit the wall and he's on the green. We've got to get this in now. Yay! Yay. William. James and William, yeah. Yep. And a uh, little match and uh, we won. You did. Right, what are you hitting? Three wood. Three wood? Yeah. Is that not your rescue? No. You are You need an half. Yeah, and one up, two to play. That's in a bunker, that, aren't you? are done like a kipper there, I think. Straight in. It's got to be. No, it's short. It's in it? between them, where I placed it. Oh, my giddy aunt. Right, That's where I fall. placed it. What do you mean where you place it? Don't even think about it. you had a if that didn't kick right. If that you can a see, I've aimed there and it's gone right between the bunkers where, where I've aimed to hit the ball. Are you, you saying set you it play on the tin? Ungover. Set it on the tin. Do you tin. play better golf on over? Sometimes. <laughs> if you got me a few more drinks, we'll be improperly on over. <laughs> over to you. Right, you need a good shot here, Mr. Harrison. I do. I'm well in play. I think you got the right club. If you hit a good shot, you'd be well over them no, bunkers. I should be fine by him, but you forced me on. Mind you, last night were good. You were having a laugh at bar staff, weren't you? Oh, yeah. Gladys. Yeah, Flora. Heidi. And Debbie from Dallas. <laughs> I'm not even going to go there, but what a laugh we had with them. Good right. girls. The golden girls. Big hit. Left of the bunker. That's all I wanted, left. Big shot. Got to be there, hasn't it? Yeah, it's over that mound, past the left-hand bunker. Oh, who's singing now, Chops? Who's singing now? Me. Come on. Come I'm on, one Chops. Up. That's why I'm singing. You've got it all to do. Right, Mr Barlow. Yeah. I don't know you've done it. That's two holes on the bounce. You can go a little bit big here as a backstop. What are you hitting? Nine. One, three, five. What a golf shot, he's all over the pin, all over the pin. Is it the number? Has it gone big? What a shot. Can't see it. I think you've hit back of the hill and it's shot on. Good strike. Can't see. You're a Muppet. If you're wondering what we're doing, Mr Barlow has run over the ball. Any old trick will do for him. 
I was trying to sink it in the ground so you couldn't see it. Still need bolt hands here. No, because I think if you go a little bit big, it'll roll back down the hill. Well, it looks like it will. Still a bit damp. It's early doors. Nice shot. Stop! Oh, it's going to the left. Oh, it's yeah, going it's to going the to the left. No, it's wow. not in the bunker. That's a proper backstop that I pulled that as well. Fifth lucky man. I'll have a bit of that. Easy bunker. Back to all square. Come on, chops. Coming. Golf mates, he's here. So he's rolled up, he's gone a bit big. You're gonna to need to chip it here, mate. You're in the poo poo here. Let's Listen. see what you did, because you got lucky on that par three. Don't tell the soft hand scoopy what the bolt hands can't do. Come on then, what have you got? Uh, what was that? That was the uh, the soft drop shot, but didn't hit it high enough or fair enough. <laughs> the soft what? Soft hand shot, drop. <laughs> soft hand drop shot. Oh God, Jesus. Is it you now? I, I, I was in me. Right, this is par. I think I done him with that shot on the par three. Hello, 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 hello. Fast. That were all right shot, that really, wasn't it? Easy. This green's mint, isn't it? Yeah. That backdrop's good. So Fraser Brew, it's on the map. It's Aberdeenshire. There's a lot of courses around here, but this is a must come to. It's got, as Mr. Barlow says, it's got the full package. Birdie, Liam Harrison, Fraser. Oh my God. Not what it. Is, it. Is that okay? Uh, just mark it for a minute. Oh my God, what on earth? <laughs> you can tell we're intoxicated, can't you? Right, <laughs> what was that put? This Not... for a handful? Yeah, it wasn't very good, was it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, terrible. <laughs> oh. Do you want to ask now? I have what? <laughs> I got a five, you got a six. Did I? Yeah. <laughs> you give me that. I didn't. <laughs> you did, I used you give me. She ain't given. Right, golf mates, uh, the golf, well, it's a lot to be desired, isn't it? It is on that hole. So we're going to play a four, we're going to go to the 16th. We're drawing this yesterday. This is unreal. This is just the most naturalist golf hole you're ever going to see as a lynx. It's a beautiful hole. No shots. Five pound, come on. I've won that with a bogey. A birdie put to a bogey. Correct. So we're here yesterday, we had a bit of a roll up day with the golf mates. 31 golf mates from all over the area turned up and we had what a night. That was for a young man, Josh. That was for OMP. <laughs> well, we should get off square here. We should have said that last time and yeah. messed it up. Well, both Can't afford two. to mess up the same hole, being partners. I'm but you've got a cap on Rome <laughs> wasn't built in a day. The same colour golf mates. And Joe has only just realised I've got a cap on. Comment below if you think he needs glasses like Liam. That's to show luck today, that isn't it? That's it, my luck all day, golf mates. I'm going to a big shout out for a lad called Kevin. He come all the way from Brighton. I've got a club for him now. It's the Hippo Hunter. Yep. Is it coming go. for him? That's it. That's the one. That's what he needs. Three trains for getting here and a golf mate picked him up. So who class is that? Big respect, Kevin. Right, extra hole. Stroke eight. We're not playing off the whites because uh, we don't want to. <laughs> is that yeah. right, Steve? And it's down here. Come on. So it's 300. And 45 yards. Play I know I'm fall. thinking driver is the wrong club for them bunkers, but if you nail it, it'll run through them. If. Play off all, need a good strike. That's best, aren't you? It's a great shot. 
Do not go in that bunker on the right. It's still round side foot. It's massive, that, and it's well past everything. Yeah. And you it's know what? Finish. You know when you set up and you know you set up right and you swing, that's what happens. It's a great shot. Uh, I have to follow that, won't I? Oh, that'd be, that'd be hard, actually. Oh, Saying that, we'll, I'm sure we can get a six out of them, can't we? I won't, I won't just want it in play. Right. Good shot, Mr. B. Come on. What have you got? What a driller. Look at that low one. That's going to be left to right. Oh, it's running. It's running over the mound. Is it going to get gathered up by a bunker? Can't see it. No, it's slowed down over the hill. Unless it's kicked left. If it's kicked left, it's carried on running. Yeah. All right shot, but I don't think you'd be up there with Mr. Harrison. No. Because you're not as big, are you? Well, you are and you're not. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's your missus. <laughs> well, I can't see your ball, Liam. I, I think know. you're in the rough. Well, no, no. I think you're in the there. rough, rough. Yeah, like yeah, your yeah. Luke. Come on. Down the line, 150. Eight iron. Are you going to Bryson D. Chambro it all of a sudden? Eight iron, 150. Yeah. That could Tom. get there. If that kicks left. Oh, you kick, kick right. right. It'd be there or thereabouts, surely, will it? Got to be. It's got to be. Pin, uh, flag eye. Flag eye. Pin eye. Flag eye. Pin eye's gone. <laughs> Great drive, Liam. But you're never on the fairway, son. You I need to be a... Phil Nicholson to get that on the green from there. I got a bad bounce. Phil Nicholson to get that on the green from there. Who? Phil Nicholson. Mickelson, not Nicholson. That's what you need shot here. Mickelson, not Nicholson. Phil Mickelson. But you said to Nicholson. Mick you, you were drinking last night. That was easy for you to say. Yeah. I thought that was a gorgeous tee shot. Bob it said was. I had a dodgy it bounce. Rolled in the rough. Ow. That's a great shot out of that. Oh, and sit. you're on. Sit. My fingers are stinging. Go on. Go on. Go to the pit. Stop. <laughs> That's a great shot. Spanish hands. That was pure <laughs> fluke, that. That was hit and whack. I'll have my putter, Steve. You'll probably need a wedge. Oh, happy days. Oh, happy days. Right, so he's ended up there. I've had a bit of luck. Goes with the bad luck of the drive. Scoopy whoopy. Praise, bruh. It's not bad. Yeah, so it's called Fraserborough, but the locals call it here the Brock. Or something like that. Right, Mr. Barlow, I've yeah. had good luck there after my bad luck on my drive. You did. Exceptional. So but I think if the shot. golf's been that bad, I'm going to box this, make you cry, say thank you to Scotland. Yeah, it's been a great trip. And make our way home to the wife fantastic and kids. Fantastic courses, fantastic views. It's it. I'm so bad at these putts. I know what is going on. Terrible. Today. Honestly, keep off the tenants. If you're coming up to Scotland, right, for playing golf, try and not have that much tenants. That's all I'm going to say. Debbie. <laughs> Come on, Debbie. Debbie, do that again, love. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what I'm with Kevin, nearly. Yeah, I get like a couple of tenants. <laughs> 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 I'm not taking issue for Kevin. Oh, it's too late for that. <laughs> is that in your way? No, it's fine. Right, come on, Stevie. See if I can get it to the hole. <laughs> Boom! She goes! Hey, pressure's on now, isn't it? Oh, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> shake your bum, shake your bum, shake your bum. <laughs> oh. Shake your bum, shake your bum. Hey, it's just it's getting the uh, concentration. I'm going to shut up. I'm going to, I'm going to shut up. Yeah, that's unusual. You don't even show when you're sleeping. So I don't snore, it's just you. No, it's you. You just said me. I don't you just said I shut up when I'm sleeping. I said you don't shut up when you're sleeping. Easy for you to you're say. Still yucky. So the end. Oh yeah, shake your bum, shake your bum. Now I see the final curtain. Yeah! <laughs> Thank you, Scotland. Finish on a high. How <laughs> bad's my put it? I, I'm gonna call it lack of sleep <laughs> for the last week. Too much drink, lack of sleep. It's been a great trip, hasn't it? Golf mates, this is the end of the series. 10 episodes of the Hidden Gems, and I hope you loved them. We've finished on a high. Fraserburgh Golf Club, for me, has got the full package. 
golf course, hospitality. And again, big shout out to the captain, Eddie, Jerry, but more importantly, Nick. Nick's, Nick's a superstar, he's an un unsung hero. He does a lot for this club. He's, uh, he's got us here and I'm so glad that he's got us here and we've done the journey. But Mr. Barlow, yeah. what a trip. Was, fantastic. Joe's done awesome. Yeah. Starting from Sterling onwards, his videos Cheers, Joe. have been brilliant. And he doesn't snore. But he's messy, he isn't he? He's messy, isn't he? Oh, he's very messy. He's very messy, yeah, he's a messy He lad. needs a wife to look after him, yeah, tidy needs, up. Needs a, yeah. Doesn't like washing note, up. Scotland, we're going to leave it with the drone footage of us going through the mountains, Bonnie, Scotland, or Flower of Scotland, we'll be back next year.